Anywho, so today I'm going to tell you a story about high school. So during a day of school, me and my friend Sydney and my best friend Miranda were walking from the band building to the regular building. Our school's pretty small, so it's basically just like, here's the band building, here's like the play area with the playground, volleyball thing, etc. And then here's the main building. So we're walking from band to the main building. It was the last class of the day and Sydney just stops and she looks in the park and she sees this little girl that she's never seen before in her life. Which I mean, to be fair, this isn't super unusual. Sometimes just random people from the community just, you know, use the park, use the basketball court sometimes. Um, when it's after school and while well, it was about to be after school so it isn't super abnormal but she was like oh my gosh there's a child and I don't know who it is and so she just keeps looking we're like what and she's just like who's that little girl and so me being the greatest friend in the entire world look straight at this little girl and says, what little girl? And she just starts freaking out. She's like, what, you, you don't see her? And I'm just like staring at like this blank, like this face, like, are you okay, you know? But she's just like, oh my gosh. And so I'm really happy with myself. I'm like, this is the best thing I've ever done in my entire life. I have peaked in my life. I can die happy, this is great. However, my joy lasts about two seconds because Miranda, being the oblivious person that she is, she's just like, Hannah, she's right there. And I just face palmed mentally and gave her this look. And just in that moment, all my dreams were dead. And I'm just like, dang it, Miranda. Like, why must you do this to me? She like caught on, but a bit too late. When I later talked to her, she's like, oh, I tried to make it like it was just we, us that saw it. And I'm like, eh, that d didn't work, doesn't matter. You ruined it. The damage had already been done. There was no going back, no saving the glorious moment that gave me joy in life. It was over. She just thought that I was just really unobservant, which to be fair, I am a, a little unobservant. I'm very unobservant. But I mean, come on. I was literally staring right at the child. <sighs> well, I hope you guys enjoyed the story. Give it a like. And if you do this to your friends, I wish you the best luck in the world. And hopefully, your other friend won't tear it to shreds. Bye! <laughs> I had a dream that your sister, literally, like, I had a dream that I met your sister, and it was your birthday, and Liza, she came to meet you, and you were like, and I was like, oh my god, it's Liza! And you're like, that's not Dan and Phil.